Not all pets have feathers or fur. Freshwater turtles make great pets and with the right setup are easy to care for. The two most commonly kept captive turtles are the Murray Shortneck and the Eastern Longneck. The Murray Shortneck is found throughout the Murray Darling systems and spends 95% of its time in the water. The Eastern Longneck is found in slow moving bodies of water such as dams and will often move between dams after heavy summer rains. Pet turtles require an aquarium or terrarium to live in. It can be decorated using a variety of pieces of wood, rocks and ornaments. You can also use some live plants and these not only look great but are also an alternate source of food for your turtle. When planning your tank, ensure there aren't any areas where your turtle could become wedged because as strange as it sounds, they can drown. The terrarium requires a dry area where your turtle can climb out to dry itself. Some terrariums have a shelf built in for this, or you can use a turtle dock, which mounts onto the back of any terrarium. Depending on the size of the terrarium, either a canister filter or an internal filter will achieve this. The filter should be cleaned out on a regular basis and the filter material changed when necessary. Your turtle will only eat in the water, and it can be quite messy, so it's best to feed small amounts over a few minutes, rather than all the food in one go. Although turtles are omnivores, their primary diet should be meaty foods such as frozen turtle dinner, blood worms, chopped up raw prawn, and also a commercial turtle pellet. Green foods can be derived from placing plants in the terrarium or small amounts of finely chopped Asian greens. Turtles, like all reptiles, are ectotherms, meaning that they heat up from the outside in. They require an external source of heat so they can be active and digest food. The most effective way to achieve this is to heat the water of the aquarium with an aquarium heater. All turtles require a source of UVA and UVB light so they can absorb calcium to keep their shells strong. The bones and claws of the turtle also require UVB light on a daily basis. Turtles also require a day-night cycle known as the photo period. All of the UVA, UVB and photoperiod requirements can be achieved by using a UV5 fluorescent tube across the top of the tank. Turtles rest for large portions of the day, up to 14 hours, so regular photoperiod is essential. If you need more information, drop in and see us at We Know Pets in Barrel.